say you? Wow, you guys are great. There's so many of you. Woo, 609 to be exact. So welcome to this 2013 commencement ceremony. Please stand as you are able as Dr. Joshua Baum, Assistant Professor of Music, sings our national anthem, and Dr. Jonathan Dean, University Chaplain and Assistant Professor of Religion, offers the invocation. <laughs> So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket red giver of life and learning, creator of all that is noble and true. We gather together today a fellowship of love and thanksgiving. We are grateful for the celebration of this day, the recognition of achievement and the rewarding of labor. We rejoice in the communities that sustain our living and our exploration, for families, for friends, for those who nurture, teach, inspire and counsel us. Be present in our joy and in our gratitude. Bless those who will graduate today. In their proper pride, may they remember compassion. In their joy, may they know fulfillment. In their ambition for their future, may they find a deeper desire to mend a broken world. And may all of us, graduates, families, guests, teachers, and witnesses to their achievement, find renewed strength today and for the future in this moment. May our vision for our lives be enlarged, our hope for humanity emboldened, and our desire for peace and unity rekindled. So may we and all your children finally be free. Amen. Please be seated. a lot younger. It's not supposed to bother you to stand for half an hour. As president of Aurora University, I'm pleased to welcome you to this 2013 commencement ceremony. We gather today for several purposes. To celebrate the achievements of our graduates and to give thanks for the faculty and staff, family and friends, who helped our degree recipients realize their goals. On such occasions, we pay tribute also to the shared values of our university community, a commitment to the core values of integrity, citizenship, continuous learning, and excellence, and our deep-seated understanding that learning has the power to transform lives and indeed societies for the better. 
Members of the class of 2013, we are proud of you and your accomplishments. We know how hard you've worked and realize also how much you've grown. Our aspirations for you are unbounded. In the words of that great philosopher, Dr. Seuss, <laughs> congratulations, today is your day, you're off to great places, you're off and away. And will you succeed? Yes, you will indeed, 98 and 3 quarters percent guaranteed. As an independent institution of higher education, AU is governed by a board of trustees. We rely upon the wisdom, generosity, and dedication of our trustees to fulfill our promise to students and to perpetuate the AU mission over time. As one sign of the care they have for you and your university, our trustees participate in commencement. May I ask them to stand and receive our gratitude. Ron Hamm was elected to the Aurora University Board in 1985 and was selected as chair several years ago. He is a native of Oswego and graduated with undergraduate degrees and law school degrees from Western Illinois University and John Marshall Law School, respectively. He's a partner in the firm of Al Schuler, Simons, and Hamm. I'm pleased to introduce to you Ron Hamm who will bring greetings in behalf of the Board of Trustees. Thank you, Dr. Sherrick. Um, it's not a prerequisite that you meet must be somewhat elderly to chair the board, but more often than not, that's the case. And uh, that was brought home to me today as I looked out and I said to Dr. Sherrick, but well, the students look so young. And she said, Ron, that's the faculty. <laughs> but I am uh, honored to represent the Board of Trustees on this very important occasion. As trustees, I share with my colleagues a wide range of responsibilities, from safeguarding the university's financial health, to monitoring the effectiveness of the curriculum, to championing the welfare of AU in the community. Like other members of the university community, trustees enjoy plays, concerts, lectures, and athletic contests. We cheer for the Spartans and take pleasure in our students' achievements. Even as we participate in the events of today, we keep one eye on tomorrow. Ours is the duty to ensure that Aurora University grows ever stronger from one generation to the next. Graduates, we share your belief in the transformative power of learning, and we are inspired by your example. Congratulations. You have our respect and best wishes. Award is presented each spring to an exemplary member of the graduating class. Candidates for this award embody the university commitment to character and scholarship. David Aquino is the 2013 recipient of the Spartan Award. He is a candidate for the Bachelor of Science degree and will speak in behalf of his classmates. Dr. Sherrick, faculty, staff, parents, loved ones, leaders, athletes, Greek members, dreamers, full-time workers, late-night studiers, procrastinators, and above all, incredibly hard workers. It is such an honor to have been selected as this year's Spartan Award recipient. When I received this award a couple weeks ago, I was overwhelmed with happiness and joy. It was humbling to be recognized, to know that my hard work and my aspirations have not gone unnoticed. 
But then, when I learned that the recipient had to deliver the keynote address, <laughs> those feelings turned to discomfort. You know, like that sick feeling when you walk into class and you realize there's a test that you completely forgot about? Yeah, that feeling. I mean, what can I possibly say to inspire my fellow classmates? I mean, most of you are my age. So I did what most 22-year-olds would do. I put it off. <laughs> I tried to start it right away. I really did. I, would, I tried coming to school before 8 a.m., but I didn't realize musical parking spaces was played so early. I tried going to the quiet zone for the first time ever. You know, that tiny room in the library where you're actually supposed to be quiet? <laughs> but I only managed to do everything but think of what to say. I probably logged on to Facebook a good 10 or 12 times. I even took the time to read an email from Brian Kipley. <laughs> you know that guy who fills your inbox with AU sports updates? <laughs> well, it turns out we have a tennis team. But then I had a breakthrough. I asked myself an important question. Who do I want to be? How can I inspire all of you if I don't know who I want to be? What I can tell you is who I was and who I am now. Before coming to AU, I was your average high school student. I went to school, I did my homework during class, I studied every now and then for tests, and I was hardly ever involved with any extracurricular activities. But as graduation approached, I remember all the top students in my class. You know, those students who got 5.0s on 4.0 scale? <laughs> yeah. They would talk about what they wanted to do with their lives and who they wanted to be. At that time, I didn't know who I wanted to be. I just wanted to be done with school. But deep down, I knew those were the students that were going to be successful one day. So when I came to AU, I knew I had a fresh start. As I'm sure many of you did too, whether you were a high school student transitioning into, into college or returning adult, continuing your, edu your education, I had an opportunity to change who I was, and I did. I got involved with clubs and organizations, and I started to apply myself in my schoolwork. I started to become the student I really wanted to be, and for that, I have more people to thank than just myself. I didn't get to be a successful student on my own. You see, to me, the Spartan Award isn't about my accomplishments, but it's the lessons I learned through the relationships I built along the way. I did not earn this award on my own, but I had parents that taught me, professors that mentored me, and peers that encouraged me. All of you have shaped me into the leader I am today. First, my parents. They are my role models. They have set my values and supported me step by step in every decision I've made. They motivated me to want more for myself, and the best of all, they loved me. Second, my professors. They are my mentors who challenged me to be above average, who pushed me to get involved, and who believed in me. And finally, my peers. All of you have helped me along this journey. Together, we've organized events, conquered projects, and studied for exams late at night. And best of all, we've created long-lasting memories together. I'd like to thank everyone who has supported me along this journey. Now, if the class of 2013 could stand up. And if you could help me give our parents, our faculties, our loved ones, or anyone who has supported you and is here today, a round of applause. So as you venture off into the, oh, you can sit down. <laughs> so as you venture off to the real world, ask yourself, who do I want to be? And just know that you have support from all sorts of people and that you are not alone. You see, we have an opportunity to start over again as we enter our careers. 
So for the most part, it doesn't matter who you were or who you are. What matters is who you're going to be. Who do I want to be? I want to be David, the role model, the mentor, the leader, the friend, and finally, I want to be the accountant. <laughs> yeah, that's right. They picked an accountant to give this speech. Um, thank you, and good luck with your journey. When distinguished members of college or university communities retire, they sometimes are awarded emeritus status in acknowledgement of their achievements. Today, as a result of unanimous action by the Board of Trustees of Aurora University, I am pleased to introduce Stephen Lowry, Professor Emeritus of Art. Please join me in congratulating Steve upon this milestone in his career. In 1976, the institution's most prestigious faculty award was established by a former dean of Aurora College in memory of his father. Upon his own death years later, the award was renamed to recognize the accomplishments of both father and son. The Marcus and Mark Trumbo Award for Excellence in Teaching is presented annually to an exemplary member of the university's faculty. This year's recipient will present reflections at the honors convocation next spring. Our award winner has rendered remarkable service to colleagues on the faculty and to her own students by championing teaching and learning and the improvement of teaching throughout her career. 
She literally makes it her mission to teach our teachers to be even more effective. As Provost of Aurora University, I am honored to present the 2013 Trumbull Award to Dr. Joan Erickson. celebrate the lifelong achievements of a truly courageous woman, Magda Brown. A number of times in recent years, she has shared her story with Aurora University students, faculty, and staff. And each time, we have listened in awe and have renewed our own commitment to teaching today's students about the horror of the Holocaust. I invite Dr. Jonathan Dean and Ellen Goldberg to escort Magda Brown to the podium for conferral of the degree Doctor of Humane Letters. The Crimea Auditorium was packed in 2010 when she first came to Aurora University to speak about her experiences in the Holocaust. AU students, faculty and staff, as well as local high school students and community members listened with rapt attention as she related the stories of her past, touched by her courage and her great dignity. When she returned in 2011 to tell the next chapter of her story, coming to the United States as a refugee, the AU community again was moved and inspired. Now, she's a frequent visitor to our history and religion classes, where she brings the past to life and helps us all to discover what really matters. Her name is Magda Brown. She is a shining link to history for today's students and the whole AU community. Born in Hungary in 1927, Magda enjoyed a normal childhood in a loving home. But all of that changed in March of 1944 when German troops marched into Budapest. Deportations of Hungarian Jews to Auschwitz-Birkenau began shortly after and half of the Jews in Hungary were deported. When the Hungarian regime was overthrown, the Nazis and Hungarian police created a ghetto in Magda's hometown of Mischkoltz, where she found her bedroom suddenly filled with several other families. That experience would pale in comparison to the events of Magda's 17th birthday in June of 1944, when she and her family were crowded onto a rail car. The destination, Auschwitz-Birkenau. When the train arrived, Magda and her family were immediately separated. It was the last time she saw them as they were sent directly to get to the gas chambers. Magda was spared from the gas chambers at Auschwitz and transported a few months later to Allendorf, Germany, a sub-camp of the Buchenwald concentration camp. She worked in a large ammunition factory for 8 to 12 hours a day. In March of 1945, she dodged death, death once again. While on a death march to Buchenwald, she and several other prisoners escaped and hid in a nearby barn. American soldiers arrived just one and a half days later liberating Magda and her fellow captives. After returning to Hungary to search for her extended family, Magda was sponsored by relatives here in America and various Jewish organizations to earn a visa to the United States. She arrived in America on September 17, 1946, but was reunited with her brother only in 1962. Despite her experience, Magda is not angry or bitter. She has drawn upon her past to learn to heal, to give to others, and even miraculously to forgive for what was done to her and her family. She says her greatest gift 
was that of American citizenship. The group of survivors established the Illinois Holocaust Museum and Education Center in Skokie, and Magda is a staunch supporter and participant in their Speakers Bureau. She is open, truthful, and courageous as she connects AU students to the reality of the Holocaust in unforgettable ways. No longer is this chapter of history merely something we read about in textbooks. Our admiration only grows as Magda tackles the most difficult questions. She asks and helps us to ponder the toughest questions. Where was God in Auschwitz? Having studied or lived the Holocaust, where do we find hope? The students and all of us who know her adore her. Thanks to Magda Brown, our students will remember and teach their children and their grandchildren to remember. She has changed our lives, helping us to discover what is important. One student said to me, after seeing how forgiving Magda is, my hope is that I can start seeing things more broadly and be more loving and accepting of others and of their differences. In recognition of her dignified, profound courage and her tireless efforts to share the Holocaust story with others, the Board of Trustees of Aurora University, with the enthusiastic support of faculty and administration, is proud to bestow upon Magda Brown the degree of Doctor of Humane Letters, honoris causa, on this, the fifth day of May, 2013. responsibilities and privileges thereto appertaining. Congratulations. Thank you. Madam President, members of board of directors, faculty and students, you cannot imagine how moved I am at this moment for many, many reasons. I am accepting this honor on behalf of all the survivors who were destined to live. And there are not too many of us. As you know the Holocaust history, you know how many millions have perished for no reason. So we go, all of us survivors, and give of ourselves because we were given this extra time to live and we try to share our stories for one important reason, that you, the future generation, should learn from our tragedies. We go, we talk, we listen, we answer many, many questions. We at the Illinois Holocaust Bureau have a group of speakers and we are getting up in age, so some of us who are still able to drive or travel away, we go. Matter of fact, just a few days ago, I was in the neighborhood at Oswego High School. I spoke to 700 young, interested students. And what a joy it is how they ask questions and how they are interested in on the subject. I would like to share something with the students. Something that I want you to remember and truly appreciate today. It is an auspicious moment for you. You have gained the recognition of getting your diploma. But let me tell you something. When I was your age, how different it was. I was in the middle school, ready to enter higher education. 
Unfortunately, there was a horrendous anti-Jewish law called the Numerous Clauses, which restricted Jewish children to 1% of the entry to higher education. So when I, my, my time came, me, me, eagerly I was looking forward to it. My grades were good, and in those days, uh, parents have to pay for tuition. My parents would be able to pay for my tuition, so that wasn't an issue. Unfortunately, I didn't make that quota. Now you have to recognize when you're a teenager, you really are not so f knowledgeable about history and world politics. You are thinking of yourself, and why couldn't I get into this? So the reason I mention this to you, think about it. What happened to you when you were ready to look for a university? You had all the choice in the world. You had good grades, naturally but you could go to this university or that, your freedom of choice. The only other issue was perhaps financial arrangements, but even that you could secure through financial aid. So there were all these beautiful free <coughs> benefits that you, are, you were blessed to. And therefore, every time I speak, I promote the word freedom. It is horrible to be a slave. And let's give all of our efforts to protect the freedom in this country that we so beautifully enjoy. Go out into the world, succeed, and do great things. But the one, number one thing that you should keep in mind, give of yourself. Volunteer. Because I have not reached this plateau without the help of many, many volunteers who helped me. God bless the 6th Armored Division who liberated me, and followed by the many volunteers from a variety of organizations who helped me get further. God bless the mentor I had, my physician, who was my employer for 40 years, who saw in me enough abilities with a limited education to work with him for 40 years in his medical office. And success, many, many events were following. So keep that in mind. Give of yourself, and I wish you a wonderful, wonderful career in a, peace, in a free, wonderful society. Thank you very much. Candidates for the degrees Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Science in Nursing, and Bachelor of Social Work of the Aurora University Class of 2013. We only have about another hour or so of speeches before we get to you guys. <laughs> you have traveled different roads to a common destination. In a few minutes, we will confer your degrees, read your names, and present your diplomas. In these moments, we will mark the conclusion of one chapter in your lives in the beginning of another. First, however, I also invite you to stand and to join me. I invite you to stand. Thank you. And to join me in thanking the faculty, staff, family, and friends who nurtured your educational aspirations. President Sherrick, I present to you the 2013 graduating class eligible for baccalaureate degrees. Each has met all academic requirements or will do so later this summer. All have been approved by the faculty and the Board of Trustees and thus are now eligible to receive their degrees. So we're going to add a piece here so your family can find you. When I read the name of your degree, raise your hand, okay? So that they can pick you out in the crowd. Got it? Yeah, it's your last test, okay? <laughs> As president of Aurora University, I now confer upon you the degrees of Bachelor of Arts. A plus. Great. Bachelor of Science. <laughs> B 
Bachelor of Science in Nursing. And Bachelor of Social Work. I confer these degrees in accordance with the requirements you have completed. And I grant to you all of the rights, privileges, honors, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. Congratulations. It is now appropriate for you to move your tassels from the right side to the left. I'd ask the first row of graduates to remain standing. The rest of the graduates may sit. Please come forward to receive your diplomas as I read your name. Daniel L. Evans, summa cum laude. Norma Anguiano, magna cum laude. Jennifer A. Acevedo, cum laude. Mary Adams. Ryan A. Adams, cum laude. Ryan! Maria G. Aguilera Guerrero, cum laude. Lauren Elaine Albrecht. Paula Lindsay S. Alcaraz. Norman B. Allison, summa cum laude. Matthew Ryan Allred. Justin R. Alozio. Ethan J. Amoni, cum laude. Gage F. Anderson. Marissa Ann Angelari. Lisette Arambula. Amanda C. Ardeline. Kathleen Bridget Armstrong. Anilda Baliozzi. Maximilian R. Balan. Zachary T. Barnwell. Raquel Barrera. Crystal M. Battistella, summa cum laude. Trevor S. Bauer. <laughs> David P. Bauman, cum laude. Michael George Beater. Kimberly A. Bellinger, cum laude. Melissa K. Benneke, magna cum laude. Martha J. Benjamin. Ariel B. Bennett, magna cum laude. Rachel L. Benson. Sonia L. Berg. Matthew K. Burmis. Brian J. Blazek. Dale G. Bolthouse. Eliana C. Borjas. Erica L. Burasa, magna cum laude. Travis L. Boyd, summa cum laude. 
Tevin M. Boyette. Sarah Ann Boyle, cum laude. Shane A. Brady, manya cum laude. Sarah E. Brandenburg, summa cum laude. Glenna L. Breinigan. Dana M. Brinkman. Caitlin A. Bruff, cum laude. Jenna J. Brown. Sarah A. Brooker, magna cum laude. Nicholas H. Buba. Alyssa J. Buckholtz, magna cum laude. Brittany M. Buttemeyer, magna cum laude. Michael A. Bumber. Shane F. Bergwald, summa cum laude. Kevin D. Burke, cum laude. Sarah D. Burnett, summa cum laude. Mozella Burton. Karen Butler Cruz, summa cum laude. Danielle N. Capriel. Raymond S. Cardenas. Crystal M. Carreno. Rosa Casas, summa cum laude. Patricia Chuddy, cum laude. Allison Rose Chunglo, summa cum laude. Kylie P. Sykish. Christopher V. Claps. <laughs> Megan J. Clayson, summa cum laude. Caitlin C. Clausen, cum laude. Kelly Beth Clayton, cum laude. <laughs> Carrie Ann T. Cobb, cum laude. <laughs> Kyle A. Koya. Aisha M. Cole, cum laude. Alma R. Colton, summa cum laude. Christina E. Canena, cum laude. Catherine M. Connolly. Derek M. Cooper, manya cum laude. Margaret G. Cooper, summa cum laude. Christopher D. Cope. Sarah B. Cornelius, summa cum laude. There's always one. Kendra V. Coronado. Constance Elizabeth Cosgrove. Christine N. Cotto. Nicholas R. Chia. Eric M. Dabs, cum laude. Jane M. Danielewski. Brian M. Davis. Deanna Cherie Davis. Kiri L. Davis. Shaquise LaShawn Dawkins. Monica Lynn Diorio, summa cum laude. Itzel De La Hoya, magna cum laude. Marissa I. Di Nicolo. Brianna Deckard. Charles E. Denon. Emily S. Densmore, summa cum laude. Alexandra M. Derry, cum laude. Samantha L. Dixon, magna cum laude. 
Jordan Ann Dobbins. <laughs> Stephanie E. Dolce, summa cum laude. <laughs> Ashley E. Dume, summa cum laude. <laughs> Samantha Dungy, summa cum laude. <laughs> Alex M. Dunk. Kate M. Eisenhower, summa cum laude. Michael J. Emma. Eric Eduardo Espinoza, cum laude. Albert L. Eubanks. Alyssa W. Evans, cum laude. Garrett J. Fair. Alfonso Fajardo, cum laude. Ashley Leanne Farmer, summa cum laude. Laura E. Feller, magna cum laude. Victoria J. E. Finley. Samantha K. Fisher, summa cum laude. Amanda Christine Fishback, magna cum laude. Jennifer A. Flurdy, summa cum laude. Christian Raymond Foote. Brooke K. Franson, cum laude. Jessica C. Freeland, magna cum laude. Luke A. Frey. Megan M. Frey, cum laude. James P. Gabriel, cum laude. Tomas A. Garza, Jr. Bernadette M. Garcia. Kendra A. Gay. Stephen R. Gerke. Luke V. Gilbertson. Matthew Gillette, cum laude. Morgan N. Getchell. Cameron J. Goltry, summa cum laude. Kelly A. Gorski. Brooke A. Graham. Jessica Grazulis. Jory L. Green. Kevin M. Green. Oscar T. Green. Shannon H. Gravis, cum laude. Ruth H. Grill. Sherry L. Guarnizzo. Anna K. Guerrero. <laughs> Alma E. Gutierrez, cum laude. <laughs> Keely M. Haig, summa cum laude. <laughs> Matthew T. Hafner. Erin L. Ham. <laughs> Lakeisha Renee Hampton. <laughs> Stacy Y. Hera. Camilla S. Harris. Kristen Renee Hart. Emily N. Harwood. Jonathan R. Heaven. Shauna M. Hine. Justina M. Helmick. Kiera S. Henderson. Terrence C. Henry. Robert Harris. Elizabeth Jean Harriet. Candida L. Hernandez. 
Alexa Emmeline Hill, summa cum laude. Ryan Michael Hiller, cum laude. Nicole C. Holmes, cum laude. Margaret E. Helche. Tiffany Ann Howard, cum laude. Alexander R. Hoyle. Martha A. Infante, cum laude. Douglas Ryan Ingold, cum laude. Tamika L. Jackson. Anna E. Iwanski, summa cum laude. Natalie A. Jansen, summa cum laude. Lakeisha S. Jenkins. Renee T. Johans, magna cum laude. Jason N. A. Johns. Joshua F. Jore. Jasmine J. Justice. Morgan L. Kampner, cum laude. Stephen J. Karasuski, summa cum laude. Jocelyn J. Karbach. Jacqueline M. Keating. James R. Kelly, cum laude. Blake W. Kennedy, cum laude. Sean M. Keogh. Joel T. Kipping. Cassandra L. Kleshevsky, summa cum laude. Aaron J. Kleimeyer. Chelsea B. Cleese. Paul J. Cluxon. Kevin D. Nicely. Michael P. Corpe. Dustin P. Kraus. Gina M. Legilio. Legilio. Joshua H. Larson. Christina N. Landry. Kelsey Marie Lavery, cum laude. Crystal S. Lash. Lauren A. Lecco, cum laude. Andrew M. Lemaster. Kelly A. Lemezis, magna cum laude. Patricia Kijian Lu, cum laude. Amy Suzanne Lacante, cum laude. Gina R. Lohr. Jacqueline R. Loftus, cum laude. Laura A. Long. Diana Lopez. Annie Lorenz. Kylie B. Lowe. Christina A. Loy, cum laude. Samantha A. Lund. Michael A. Lundeen, magna cum laude. Sandra Maldonado. Carlin D. Mandley. Jessica Ray Manigold, cum laude. Katarzyna M. Merrick. Bethany A. Marlott. Elizabeth A. Marsh, magna cum laude. Alonzo Martinez. Jasmine Martinez, summa cum laude. 
Michael Luis Martinez. Kristen N. Martin. Noah C. Martin, cum laude. Sarah J. Martin. Sarah E. Mayberry. Ashley M. Meyer. Erin Elizabeth McCroskey. Emily Erin McDonald. Alvin R. Medina. Christina A. Mendez. Carrie Ann Maselli, Magna Cum Laude. Michelle L. Smith Miller. Kimberly A. Milton. Daniel Mojica, Magna Cum Laude. Eric C. Moore, Magna Cum Laude. Megan K. Moore. Anna L. Morataya. Derek C. Morrison. Spencer G. Morrissey. Peter M. Morsevillo. Shireen Muckerman, summa cum laude. Joseph Charles Mislovich, cum laude. Time out. Daniel L. Negre. Daniel J. Nelson, summa cum laude. Timothy James Nelson, summa cum laude. Colby R. Newquist. Terry Wing. Beth J. Nicholson. Scott Michael Noblet. Joshua A. Norton. Alyssa E. Ochoa. Jessica L. Edder, cum laude. Jeffrey A. Olson, cum laude. Daniel P. Olson. Melissa Orozco. Joel Ortega, Jr. Thomas S. Oslansky. Adriana Pacheco Nieves. Alejandro Gabriel Paredes. Tiffany M. Perillo, summa cum laude. Catherine Bridget Pauls, summa cum laude. Stephen N. Parsons. Jason J. Penrod. Jose D. Perez. Angela L. Ozanic. Miranda L. Peterson, cum laude. Elizabeth M. Pfaff. Caitlin F. Pietrezic, cum laude. Amanda J. Hordney, cum laude. Janelle M. Palera. Renee Portillo. Donald L. Powers. Brian Allen Price, Jr. Aliyah M. Pennenberg, cum laude. Simone Lee Quinn, summa cum laude.
Luis J. Quintanilla, Magna Cum Laude. Jacqueline E. Rakers, Summa Cum Laude. Maria Fernanda Ramirez. Kirsten M. Rasmussen. Carla Reese, Summa Cum Laude. Rachel A. Wren, Magna Cum Laude. Richard M. Retzinger. Constance Marie Ravel. Amber L. Rice. Diane Marie Riffle. Jessica L. Rivera. Jaquila T. Roberts Clark. Raquel Rodriguez. Zaida Rodriguez. Paige E. Rogers, Magna Cum Laude. Tegan M. Rogers. Emily P. Ruzanellos, Cum Laude. Kristen Angeline Rosnick. Mary Elizabeth Rashavi, Magna Cum Laude. Danielle B. Scardigno. Allison M. Sheely, Summa Cum Laude. Nicole E. Scott. Allison A. Shimkus. Nolan J. Siegler, Summa Cum Laude. Carly H. Simmons. Kaylee Brooke Suido, Cum Laude. Nicholas J. Sloan. Catherine Jean Smetana, Summa Cum Laude. Alexa P. Smith. Angela L. Smith. Kelly N. Smith, Cum Laude. Joseph A. Soto. Daniel J. Spanier, Magna Cum Laude. Kyle M. Spooner. Jordan L. Sperling. Yeah! Holly Elizabeth Renee Stark. Marjorie Soto, Summa Cum Laude. Alexandria M. Stevenson, Magna Cum Laude. Michael H. Stewie, Cum Laude. Wei Swocha, Jamie N. Sutherland, Tracy L. Swain, Cum Laude, Casey Alyssa Swanson, Cum Laude, Melissa Ann Talkington, Lisa M. Taylor, Megan Michelle Taylor, Magna Cum Laude. Michelle C. Taylor, Summa Cum Laude. Jenna L. Teagarden. Molly C. Thayer, Cum Laude. Emily A. Tillman, Summa Cum Laude. Jesus M. Torres, Jr., Cum Laude. Darcy L. Tucker. Alyssa M. Tarek, Cum Laude. Jeffrey Lester Turner. Rissa D. Rabina. 
Alyssa K. Valdez, magna cum laude. Leslie I. Valderez. Alan Van Pienbrick. Andrew M. Vaughn. Kevin Vita. Alejandro Villa, cum laude. Diana Villa Gomez, Villa Gomez. Laura K. Vincent, summa cum laude. Maureen R. Wagner, cum laude. Corey Walden. Tiffany R. Walls, magna cum laude. Timoth Washington. Jason C. Watkins. Jacob John Paul Weisbrot, cum laude. Daniel W. White, cum laude. John M. Whitney. Brett S. Wilder. Samuel J. Williamson. Christine M. Wirtz. Jacob Edward Krauts. Jennifer A. LaPointe. Ryan A. Woods. Jaquille B. Wright. Alina G. Zamorano. <laughs> Isabel Zamudio, magna cum laude. Peter A. Zarides, magna cum laude. Matthew W. Abens. J. Daniel Albertson. Estefania Barrera, magna cum laude. Jason M. Aloisio, cum laude. David Aquino, summa cum laude. And your Spartan award winner. Eric Antonio, cum laude. Julie A. Arroyo. Jacob C. Behrens. Maria Elena Benitez, magna cum laude. Sarah Lynn Blowers. Ivan M. Bugnarchuk, cum laude. Tammy R. Bresnak, cum laude. Chad Allen Briant. Lizette D. Cambrin. Claudia Chavez. Kelly A. Coleman, cum laude. Harry C. Procopus, summa cum laude. Rehan Rehani. Brennan J. Roush, Roush. <laughs> Maria De La Luz Contreras, summa cum laude. William W. Cox. Caitlin A. Crohan, summa cum laude. Kayla Nishimini Davies, summa cum laude. Kristen M. Day, summa cum laude. Shannon C. Day, summa cum laude. Kristen F. Stathiu. Ryan J. Franson. Jordan Patrick Fryer. P. 
Peter L. Gallagher, cum laude. Ashley J. Gillespie, summa cum laude. Ashley N. Gerard, magna cum laude. Ricardo Hernandez. Jordan M. Hera. Andrew James Huss, cum laude. Catherine M. Kaltenbach, cum laude. Monica E. Castle, cum laude. Matthew J. Konechny, summa cum laude. Thomas M. Labellarty, Labellarty. Amanda Ray Liss, summa cum laude. Jessica S. Labraco. Aaron N. Looney. Brandon M. Martin, cum laude. Michelle M. Mathis. Daniel J. McCarty Crane. Seth E. McCoy, cum laude. Samuel P. McKinney. Jordan N. McMillan. Andrea Claire, oh, I'm sorry, Andrea Claire Morris, magna cum laude. Anais A. Moton. Justine M. Mueller, cum laude. Matthias J. Muno. Brenda Ortega Melkor, summa cum laude. Kristen J. Palaki, cum laude. Damaris E. Perez. Sarah M. Palmatier, cum laude. Furman Perez, summa cum laude. Emiliano G. Punts. Ainsley E. Richards, magna cum laude. Christina M. Rogalski. Robert Jason Sanchez. Brittany K. Shank, cum laude. Joel A. Silva, magna cum laude. Jonathan M. Simmons. Virginia R. Smith, magna cum laude. Matthew P. Snyder. Carolina Soria. Alicia N. Spangler. Mache G. Stancic, cum laude. Sydney Devon Souter. Hatal N. Talati. Amanda Susan Taylor. Jason J. Toussaint. Nicolina Varagic. Summa cum laude. Robert M. Walsh, cum laude. Jacob C. Wilkowski. Cameron S. Wisnowitz. Kyle J. Zimmerman. Stephen M. Zoper, Jr. Robert C. Zofi. Paige L. Bank.
Anna Marie Elizabeth Benko, cum laude. Alexandra Blondo. Riley S. Burke, magna cum laude. Chelsea R. Burrell. Tudor V. Buzulio. Megan Michelle Byrne. Janine P. Shishelsik. Jessica Diaz. Laura A. DiCanio. Catherine May Dupuy. Krista L. Fogarty. Laura Garcia. Alyssa M. Genitazio. Morgan P. Gibson. Emily J. Gorup. Brooke K. Gossett. Brittany L. Gullickson. Jamila M. Gunnell. Jacqueline C. Hanty, cum laude. Dominique D. Herbert. Emily Ruth Hislop. Callie L. Hopkins, cum laude. Rachel A. Hussman, cum laude. Kathleen Rosemary Hutchison. Danette L. Jungles. Heather Michelle Jerkovic, cum laude. Lauren Nicole King. Amara Danielle Colias. Teresa R. Lenoza. Amy Rebecca Mabry. Ruth Marie McKenzie. Stacy Marcovicius, cum laude. Brittany Marie Mascola. Kelsey N. McMahon. Gloria A. Mitternock, cum laude. Kathleen M. Meyer. Harriet L. Miller. Daisy E. Mojica. Alejandro Morales. Jessica Navarre. Kelsey L. Olinsky. Matthew D. Orcutt, cum laude. Heather M. Owens. Norma M. Patterson. Robin M. Posey. Stephanie A. Rassman. Elizabeth Catherine Rebnier. Samantha Teresa Louise. Sarah E. Schwalm. Samantha I. Samitis. Cicely M. Senzheimer. Brittany Serna. Grace A. Sexton. Nicole Marie Stapleton. Kimberly M. Starr. Malia C. Stroud. Kathleen A. Summers. Sarah M. Tarchala. Kelsey Renee Tassen, cum laude. Elizabeth C. Thomas. Mackenzie R. Turner. Christopher S. Vida. 
Elizabeth M. White. Nicole L. Wilker. Janice Q. Zhu. Alexandra L. Zuber. Lori Aberto. Cameron J. Bayless. Shaniqua Berry, cum laude. Olivia M. Blank Stewart. Katisha Boyd. Christina J. Brown, summa cum laude. Ashley R. Buckley, magna cum laude. Melissa E. Burian, summa cum laude. Hannah B. Buss, cum laude. Ariana C. Carlson, summa cum laude. Jessica F. Carroll. Amanda E. Cummer. Yolanda L. Daly. Lauren K. Data, cum laude. Anthony S. De La Cruz, cum laude. Brittany A. Dexter. Jasmine Diaz. Brittany N. Egan. Marlene M. Eimerman, summa cum laude. Holly B. Fester. <laughs> Melissa A. Giancana, summa cum laude. Nicole O. Goddard, cum laude. <laughs> Jessica C. Goff. <laughs> Daisy Gonzalez. Portia A. Griggs. Samantha M. Hauser. Imani Alima L. Ibrahim. Sarah L. Iobi, cum, magna cum laude. Angela M. Jockman. Lydia D. King, magna cum laude. <laughs> Melissa N. Nicholson. <laughs> Theresa Kluver. Holly A. Kuhn, cum laude. Sarah Krasinski. Emily N. Lawson. Lauren Lehman, summa cum laude. Malia J. Lentz, summa cum laude. Allison Lynn Lohman. Courtney S. Lundgren. Joanne Martinez. Catherine E. Martin, summa cum laude. Vanessa Morgan Menke, summa cum laude. Carrie A. Monaco, cum laude. Kyle Moran, cum laude. Jennifer L. Nye, magna cum laude. Roberto Ochoa, Jr., summa cum laude. Stephanie F. Owen, summa cum laude. Elizabeth Palmerin. Kristen A. Palmer, magna cum laude. 
Sarah K. Paris. Carly Louise Pearson. Morgan M. Peterson, summa cum laude. Jessica L. Pittman, manya cum laude. Sophia Pliuta. Kylie A. Radis. Charnel L. Randolph, cum laude. Yvonne Marie Rios, manya cum laude. Hannah Marie Russi. I get that right? Evelyn Salcedo. Jessica Santillan. Yesenia Servan. Claire Elizabeth Sherman, cum laude. Dana E. Schantz, summa cum laude. Ashley May Sitar. Sarah C. Starkey, manya cum laude. Jessica Tomaski, manya cum laude. Nicole M. Terrell Bedell, cum laude. Christina M. Tarpe, cum laude. Aubrey E. Thornton, summa cum laude. Samantha Lee Vesley. Kayla M. Wellner, summa cum laude. Amber L. Wheeler. Carolyn Winfrey Thompson, magna cum laude. And... <laughs> Stacy L. Wright, magna cum laude. before at AU, the incredible courage of a woman dedicated to sharing her story. I hope that you will never forget this afternoon, the time when you received your degree as she received one also. I pray that life will never confront you with what Magda Brown experienced, yet like all of us, you too will know moments of sadness and moments of joy. May you find at those times the courage to cry and the courage to laugh, the strength to affirm the essence of your humanity. I pray also that you will carry from this place, this time that we have spent together, a powerful sense of what really matters to you in life and a commitment to live accordingly. No matter where you travel from here, the knowledge, the values, the skills, 
that you developed here will go also. Life around you will change because it always does. But what you leave with today will endure. And that's the magic, the transformative power of learning. And so together, we wish for you these things. May your life be one of wholeness, of integrity. May you fulfill the responsibilities of citizenship gladly and with honor. May you find in continuous learning a lifetime of joy, a forever spring. May excellence be your inspiration and lasting peace, your destination. And may the God who brought us together in this place be with you today, tomorrow, and forevermore. Amen. Now please stand for the alma mater and for the benediction. diverge for a season, for a few months, perhaps for longer. So as you go, graduates of Aurora University, may you go in peace, remembering our love and our pride and our prayers. Cherish your calling in a world that needs your courage, your passion, your insight and your vision. As you grow in faith, may you inspire and love and call others into life. Remember the unique contribution that each of you is called to make to the world. And may God bless you with wisdom and peace and joy this and every day. Amen. And now, while the trustees, faculty, and the graduates remain standing, I invite the rest of you to be seated for the recessional. When the recessional has left the tent, Please join us on the quadrangle for refreshments. And so I declare this 2013 Aurora University commencement ceremony for the fantastic, magnificent, and utterly remarkable class of 2013 complete. <laughs> <laughs>